Hey everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and today I'm going to show you how to add an image to your email signature in Gmail by using an image URL link. A lot of people are having problems adding images to their Gmail signature because you have to provide a link to the image instead of just uploading the image. And honestly, I can't believe that Gmail doesn't allow you to upload it, uh, but they don't. So we have to use a little bit of a workaround, but it's very easy. So I hope it helps and enjoy. Okay, so here I am in my Gmail account, and you may have already found where the signature settings are in Gmail, but if you haven't, I'm going to show you how to get there real quick anyways. Uh, I'm just going to go over to the right side of my account, and I'm going to click on this gear icon that says settings when I mouse over it. And then I'm going to go ahead and choose the settings option from the drop, drop down. Once I do that, on the first page of my Gmail settings, if I scroll about halfway down, I'll get to the signature section and just make sure that the radio dial below no signature is checked, not the one at the top, so you can add a signature. And you can go ahead and type whatever you want in there, your name, your phone number, your email address, whatever works for you. And then, this is the point at which most people are finding some trouble. They'll hit this insert image button, and you'll see that Gmail does not give an option to upload an image. You need to provide an image URL. And if your image is on your desktop or somewhere on your computer, you don't have an image URL. So the fastest way that I find to do that, to get an image URL for your image, is to go to imageshack.us. As you can see, I have open in this other tab right here. Um, the reason this is the fastest is because you don't have to actually create an account or log in. Uh, you could use Flickr or Picasa or even something like Google+, Plus, as long as the photo is publicly facing. Gmail needs to be able to access the photo, so if it's not open to the public, Gmail can't get to it. Uh, but like I said, imagesack.us is the quickest way to do this. So you'll see I'm right at the home page here, and it's just asking me um, whether I want to upload an image or provide a URL. I want to upload. We're going to get a URL from our upload, and I need to browse for my image. So I actually have an image on my desktop, so I'm going to click browse, get my finder window. I'm going to go to my desktop, and I want to upload this ansonalexlogo.jpg. So I'll just select it, and I'll hit open. You can see it's in the upload window. Um, you need to enter an email address just to create a free account. You're not going to have to create a password or, or fill out any other information. It's just going to send you a welcome email, so it's not a big deal. This is why this is the quickest way to upload an image. Um, this image resize option, I would recommend resizing your image before uploading it in Photoshop or whatever image editor you use, and then just selecting this do not resize option. But if you do have a really large image that you want to make smaller for your signature, you could choose a different size from the list, but I'm going to choose do not resize for this example. And this label thumb, that doesn't really matter for what we're doing, uh, so you don't have to worry about that. So once you've got everything selected in here, go ahead and just hit upload now. Shouldn't take too long, obviously it depends on the size of your image. You'll see that mine is going, and I have my progress bar here and my image is now uploaded successfully. So now we need to get our image URL. And you'll see that down here in this section that says links to share your image, I've got a bunch of different links. The one that we want is this direct link. We want the link to the actual image. So I'm just gonna select this and I'm gonna copy it. Now I'm gonna go back to my Gmail settings and I'm gonna paste the link that I just copied into this image URL field. You'll see there it is. Right away, Gmail shows me a preview of the image that's gonna be inserted into my signature. Hit OK, and there you have it. The final step is just to scroll to the bottom of your settings, click Save Changes, and you now have an image in your email signature. Just to prove it to you, I'll click on Compose, and boom, there's the image we just added. So that's the quickest way to add an image to your Gmail signature. I hope it helps, and again, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com.